My friends, if you're looking for a commercial grade walk behind broadcast salt spreader, check out the Snow X review that I have on the SP65. Tell me what you think. All right, I'm going to first tell you a little bit about the SP65. This runs approximately $350 and includes the accessory, which is a uh, salt contain. It contains the salt when it's being spread out. It's a black plastic piece, as you'll see coming up in my video. Anyways, I checked out the Boss brand and I looked online. Didn't see anybody review the Boss, and I've heard pretty good stuff about the Snow X, so I decided to go with that. So check out my video here. Okay, so check out the close-up look. Here, there's that black plastic guard. It can go across the back to protect the operator, but it's better served to go across the front, as you see later on in my video here. The hopper has a plastic cover, heavy-duty gearbox, air-filled tires. This is commercial grade. Nice screen to separate the clumps of salt, too. All right, so... I'll just show you here how you fill the hopper. Take off the plastic cover. Here's a nice look at the screen. It can come right out. All right, this salt doesn't have too many clumps in it, but that screen will definitely help to separate it. snaps on nice and here's how the spreader handles curbs pretty nice going up and down I'm happy with it okay so here's the north side of a building that doesn't get any Sun and I took the guard off the spreader and it spreads about eight feet to each side of the spreader pretty good and here's the plastic guard properly mounted to the front this is an optional piece. And you can just see how it lifts off. And it's easily mounted. Those two wire clips. Quick and easy to take on and off. And you can adjust it up a little bit or down a little bit too. And if you want to control the salt flow rate. Right there in the back. You can go forward or backward to control how far open the chute is. And on the handle right here, you'll see the on-off button right there. That controls it. All right, so that concludes my quick overview of the Snow X SP65. If you're asking me, like, what improvements would I make on it, personally for me, I'd like to see, like, some type of guard that comes all the way down across the back to keep the salt from hitting the operator when they're pushing the salt. I don't think the salt needs to come back so much, just going sideways and forward is the most important and sometimes if I take the salt spreader out and I don't have like the car guards and the boots on I'm just doing it in regular clothes the salt tends to hit my legs the jeans or whatever I'm wearing and gets into my shoes and that's something I like to see avoided so that's my take on it overall the construction is really good the gearbox the way it's held up I've had it for about two to three months now and it's worked really good so I'm happy with it so I will give you a positive review so far on all those things so please let me know if you own one of these or if you own another one what you think personally I'd say this is from what I've had before the salt the Scott's fertilizer spreader the $45 one this is a huge improvement. Even though the price is quite a bit more, this is something that looks like it's going to last a long time. So that's my take on it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. All right, so I upload new videos every Tuesday and Friday or like one or two days off from that. And if you click on that little red box in the bottom right hand corner right there, it says subscribe. Please do so. And if you want to see some other cool videos, click on one of those boxes to a link to see another similar video to this one. There you go.